Hi everybody, here's Andreas from eSurfer in our test center in Berlin. Um, we have March 2022 and it's still a little bit cold outside. However, we went out on the water with the Lampuga, the Flightboard and the Audi e-tron earlier this week and we are really ready for spring. But today we got a new box from JetSurf and uh, it's a little bit small so it's probably not a jet board uh, so let's have a look inside okay okay we got rid of the first box and guess what we have a box in a box uh, but this time it says jet surf motorized skateboard so it's an electric skateboard and uh, let's have a look inside The JetSurf Race electric skateboard. It is quite heavy, but I think it's also quite powerful, which I will learn uh, later on. Um, I can see it's used uh, because I got a free sample from JetSurf, and I guess they, they tried it before, but that's perfectly fine. Uh, the wheels are very different from what I'm used. I fear two Evolve skateboards, one with all terrain uh, wheels, one with street wheels. Uh, this is something in between and uh, very interesting. I'm looking forward to write it. But uh, okay, let's have a look what's inside as well here. It's a user manual, the charger, charger cable, USB cable, skateboard tool, and remote control. Let's have a closer look. Uh, I think we don't need to talk about the cables. Uh, the charger, 50.4 uh, volt and 2.5 ampere. Uh, I, I had it I compared it already with the Evolve uh, charger. Uh, they have a very similar size, they're using a different voltage and different ampere, but the size is almost identical, so I guess uh, it will uh, perform similar. Uh, again, such a tool is always very helpful. The user manual, I like that it has uh, a big font with a lot of pictures uh, and explains to you the basics. You see the display, all the different information you can get from the display and so on. Uh, then the remote. Uh, the trigger is here like this. And that's very similar to what Boosted used in the past, but uh, Boosted uh, board did not survive, so now we have JetSurf. Let's have a closer look to the remote control. I turned on the board uh, here underneath, uh, very similar like to the Evolve. Sorry if I always compare it with Evolve, but I guess Evolve is kind of a market leader, but it's obviously interesting to see somebody like JetSurf come with such a product, because JetSurf has also a lot of experience with electric uh, motorized uh, boards, and uh, the quality is usually excellent. So let's turn this on can see a display with plenty of information and here's the trigger and you brake like this accelerating braking what I will do now is actually charge it completely and also charge the board completely and then this weekend I will go out for some test rides looking forward to that while the remote is already charging I thought okay let's let's put them side by side yeah evolve skateboard bamboo Evolve skateboards, carbon fiber, and then the JetSurf uh, uh, carbon fiber as well. So the difference between a, a wood, wooden board and carbon fiber is that these are much stiffer, so it's better for high speeds. And of course, JetSurf is a racing company, so they want to have high speeds. That's why they went for carbon fiber. Um, if you look at the lengths, they're very similar. Uh, we have your different wheels uh, and we will have a closer look to this now. Let's have a closer look to the wheels and uh, the motors. Um, all the models have outrunning uh, motors and two of them. 
The one from JetSurf is uh, a little bit larger, so I suppose it has more power, and that's what I think, but uh, we will see once we ride it. Um, you can also see the different wheels, you know, these are street wheels, these are all terrain wheels uh, with air inside, and uh, this is quite unique here from JetSurf. It's, it's kind of in between. Uh, I usually prefer all terrain because the streets here are not so good, but these wheels should be good enough because it also has some grip here, so it, this is uh, pretty cool, and I'm really looking forward to, to test it. Let's uh, look underneath as well. As you can see, this is an older GT model. We have also GTR models here, but this is my own, which I actually already have since 2019. Um, and I like it a lot. As you can see, the jet surf is thicker and also heavier because I think it will have much more power, again, which we will show once we do the test. Um, both have very good grip. I remember I had to do this one here myself because originally it was only here and it's much better if you have it here. I think the newer models actually have it here as well, but also JetSurf has a grip tape all over the place and it's molded so you should have a pretty good stand. This will be an exciting week weekend. I will, I'm looking forward to ride this board. So, uh, I hope you found this uh, unboxing video helpful. Uh, I will charge this board. I'm looking very much forward to write it from tomorrow. And we will have another video with a full review. Uh, but this may take a couple of days, so uh, stay tuned. Uh, thanks for your support and see you soon. Bye-bye.